Yo, welcome back to another JoJo's Bizarre Adventure episode. In the last episode, we were being chased down by the Terminator himself, Gachio. That was by far the funnest boss battle that we've had in this series yet. You guys absolutely went ham on that episode with the support. We made it over 600 likes easily within that episode. Let's do the exact same thing with this episode. 600 likes for a part 7. And up next, we have chapter 7 in which I feel that we will be experiencing true fear within this episode. So without any further ado, let's get straight to it. I've decided to do chapter 7, to start chapter 7 in this video. The mystery of King Crimson. Are we for real getting to it? Group's next destination was revealed to be the island of San Giorgio to the top of the bell tower, okay? It's where you will bring my daughter. Oh, so this is a note from Diablo that they're reading. The emo. The email. Oh, here we go. What are you saying all of a sudden? Bro, this dude, Abakio, is just a hater, man. Get, stop wagging your finger in my face. If anything, I'm this group's second leader. Just by what I've done for y'all. Wait a minute, so how is this actually gonna go? I wonder whether I'll like my father. Damn, Trish. <laughs> What's up with this clean eye cutscene? Oh, so I, I, know we're, I know what's about to happen. This is gonna be crazy, actually. We'll ride that elevator to the top of the tower. Bucciarati, bro. You about to get whacked. Who? Where'd she go? Hello? Bruh turned around for one second. You had one job. There's no way. The reason the boss ordered us to escort his daughter was so he could kill her with his own hands? That's fact, man. That's a fact. My boy's trying to wipe away every single trace. You get it now. You're a smart man. I'll assassinate him right now. You don't even know where the man is. You don't know what he looks like. That's crazy. Uh-oh. Here we go. This is the battlefield for real. There she is. My girl laid out. What did he do to her? Oh. Nah, this is... This is menacing for real. This shit has got me kind of spooked. I'm not going to lie. I remember whenever I first watched part 5... I was kind of spooked about uh, Diavolo. I just love the whole mystery and him holding his identity away from everybody. Look at that. The boss in the flesh. Bro, we finally get to face off against Diavolo. Survive the boss's onslaught for one minute, bro. Bro, I'm out of there. Ooh. Yo, keep your stand away from me. Damn. Yo, he's teleporting everywhere. Oh, oh, damn. Environmental destruction. Trish, look out, girl. Damn. Okay, I'm getting hit by rocks, and he actually swung off on me right there. Damn. What? I got impaled. Bro, it's like, it's mainly the debris that's hitting me, not even him. Oh, I'm out of there. You can't touch me. You can't touch me, boy. Now I'm going to keep on rolling and dobbing and weaving like this. Ooh. I'm too slippery for you, my dude. Oh, I take that back. God, I'm almost dead with it, bro. Oh, look out. Ooh, he missed. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. No, bro. No, that's not going to work. Damn, he's spamming, bro. Relax. I'm getting pelted, bro. One second. Come on, come on, come on. We did it. We did it. Ooh, that was close. My boy was right there. My man was actually trying to go for my head. I almost died. Diavolo is on demon time for real. I'm hiding with it. That's how spooked we are. What's up? Damn. Nah, that was you, my dude. How did he do that? <laughs> that is such a sick ability. Bucciarate, you about to get it, man. I know what's about to happen. We all know what's about to happen. But you don't. The you of the few seconds ago saw you of the few seconds in the future. What? That is confusing as hell. This is my King of Crimson. I wish that we had his voice actor, his current day voice actor. Because that voice actor is cold as hell, but this one will do. Did we fail? Oh, mission complete? Nah, bro. He did it wrong. We were supposed to get slashed with a chop. That's crazy. Get off of me. Escort mission is still ongoing. This man is resilient for real. He's got a whole big ass hole in his chest. On my own mission. Damn, he said I'm the new boss. Oh, so we actually have to fight this dude for real. He's got a whole health bar. Wait, he's got more than one health bar, it seems like. Attack the boss. It doesn't say defeat the boss. Damn! Get the hell out of here. There we go. We landed a shot. Good shit, Bucciarati. Oh, nah, you suck. You suck. Ugh, damn. My boy sneaked me for real. Please, please put me down, man. Damn. There's no way for me to predict where he's going to be at. He's just going to teleport in front of me and impale me with the fist. 
damn bro he's so strong this is ridiculous golly yeah i got murked get up bro i'm getting beat up in the corner what can i do <laughs> Woo, i'm out of there boy i'm out I'm leaving. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not. Sorry, Trish. I gotta go. Jorno, help me. Help me out, dude. Oh, my God. I'm down here. Yeah. Yeah, Diavolo. Hold these hands, boy. Catch the hands. He can't do nothing when I'm all up in his face. What's up, then? He got he got armor. I'm dead as fuck. I'm dead as hell. Ooh, we did it, boy. Let's go. I landed a few shots. Somehow I managed to do that. Nah, man, I do not want to fight this dude ever again. That was stressful. This is for real a boss. Like, this is the final boss that they're preparing me for. I am not ready. You're invincible. That boy is truly is invincible, bro. And I'm out of here, boy. You should already see me on the first floor, right? So how you finna catch up to me, dude? You can't. Just because you can see me doesn't mean you can catch up to me. I'm out. Me and Trish are safe. I managed to escape to the first floor, but I'm dying, bro. Yo, Bruno, you are leaking for real. Jorno, you're a little bit too late, man. You should have been here. No, I'm just kidding. Jorno would have got clapped. It was not time for Jorno to face off against Diavolo yet. We're escaping from this church. Hurry. We got to get out of here, for real. Why are we? Don't worry about it, man. There's a threat. There's a looming threat downstairs, bro. <laughs> because this newbie arrived here. Uchirate was given a chance to escape. My man is hanging from the ledge? Yup. He's a lucky man. However, this man is really plotting. Dude, King Crimson is so menacing. Like, this is getting real... Oh, it's the boat time. Alright, bye. Bye. Um, Someone's about to abandon our cause. Okay, right to the point. The reason I brought Trish back just now. They, oh yeah, they're out of the loop. They don't know yet. I betrayed the boss. Huh? There, how could you? Nah, that boy Bucciarati, he's got a plan. I couldn't forgive him for that, so I betrayed him. I betrayed him. This is about to determine who the real and who the fake are. I have no regrets. All I can do is run. Hell yeah, boy. That resolve is what will get us far. But none of us will be stepping onto that boat. Why are you speaking for everybody, Fugo? That, that's just how you feel. Alright, Bakio, you weak as hell too, bro. But he's still gonna step. Hell yeah. With nowhere to go and no place to call home. The only time I am at peace is when you with the gang? Hell yeah. That's a real one right there. My boy Mista. Let's do it, bro. I know Bucciarati pretty well. He says a smart guy. He's a smart guy no matter what he says. Exactly, bro. Why are you all up on me like that, though? <laughs> Nah, Fugo. Fugo weak as hell, bro. Fugo, get the hell out of here. Get the stepping. I forgot, yeah. This man Narancha ain't really with it like that. Bro, make your own decisions, my dude. But let me warn you. Stay back, Narancha. You can't handle this. Oh, hey, yo. That's kind of foreshadowing a little bit. The moment the boat leaves, we'll all become traitors. Well, sayonara. We out of here, man. The realest one's on the boat right now. Nah, Fugo, you a hoe for real. You are a hoe. I'm not messing with Fugo. I never liked Fugo just because of this moment. No. This man can relate. Bro, if you don't jump in that water, if you don't take a dip right here, right now, wipe the tears off your face. That's right. You and Trish are similar. Uh-oh. Please turn around. Look at my man. <laughs> That man, yes sir, yes sir, my boy. Come on, man, let's go. Bro, this is fire for real. All right, we understand, bro. Let's go. This is the real squad. Fugo is a biatch. But Trish and the turtle, yeah, that girl is knocked for real. She needs to be revived. Please give me the turt. 
Oh no, this man can detect Bruno's lifeless body. His wounds should have healed. Yeah, nah, bro. <laughs> You're not healing from them brutal, them brutal wounds, man. He is not healing from that at all. My man is a walking zombie for real. I'll keep this to myself for the time being. Oh, so Jorno's the only one who knows. I mean, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure Bruno could feel it. Bruno Butch, oh. No, the boss is really setting out a hit on us for real. And uh, and Jorno was a prime target too. We can uncover the boss's true identity. Then we'll be able to assassinate him. That's crazy. You know, I honestly forgot how they discovered his identity. I, was it that he revealed himself? Or uh, oh wait, 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 wait. I, I remember, I remember. Never mind. The island of Sarden... I, I, I don't know how to say that name. Sardegna. Next destination is Sardegna. That'll be where we'll find the boss's identity. Let's go. Easy mission, bro. That was just a lot of exposition, to be honest. I didn't stand a chance in none of those fights. Anyways, if you guys want to see more, you already know. 600 likes. Let's get to it, bro. Thank you so much for watching.